Welcome back, lifestyle enthusiasts. We're just at shoppingguy.com, and today we're in the lifestyle. In this video, two kettlebell brands will be going head to head. We have the King's Powder Coat Kettlebell and the Onnit 18 pound Howler Primal Bell Kettlebell. Kettlebells are widely used by fitness enthusiasts as they offer a broad range of workouts to build muscle and reduce fat. Over the past decades, these handy gym tools have been increasing in popularity. This means that more and more manufacturers are producing them, requiring you more thought before choosing the right one. Of course, our team at TrustedShoppingGuy.com will only give you the best available, which is why we have set our two top kettlebell contenders to battle it out. In today's kettlebell review, we have picked the King's Powder Coat Kettlebell and the Onnit Howler Primal Bell Kettlebell, which both have garnered a 5 bench rating from our team at TrustedShoppingGuy.com. Be sure to watch until the end to see which kettlebell will be crowned as king in today's brand wars. If you are interested in the other kettlebells that we reviewed, do check out our kettlebell review video link below. If you want direct links to the products themselves, all these links are also listed below too. So without further ado, let's start the brand wars. The first category that these kettlebells will be going toe to toe with is their weight selection. Of course, the first thing that comes to mind when buying kettlebells is their weight. You'll have to decide what weight would be best suited for your workout, so the more weight options, the better. Kings offer kettlebells from 9 to 203 pounds, which gives you a vast selection of 21 kettlebells for your workout needs. The Onnit Primal kettlebells, however, offer a fewer selection with only 5 choices. A 90 pound, a 72 pound, a 54 pound, a 36 pound, and finally, an 18 pound kettlebell. The obvious winner in this round is none other than Kings, allowing for a much wider range of kettlebells. The second category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their overall build. The build of your kettlebell is directly proportional to the success of your kettlebell workout. You'll surely want your kettlebell to last, so choosing the most well-built option is necessary. The King's powder coating protects the kettlebell from scratching and chipping easily. In addition to that, this kettlebell is also made from one single piece of solid cast iron, which makes it more durable than two separate parts welded together. The Onnit, on the other hand, features a chip-resistant powder coating that's durable and consistent. In addition, it's made with a single piece of iron much like its opposition, ensuring a solid build. When placed side by side, these two competents are equally matched in this category, leading us to give them a point each. The third category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their handle quality. When choosing a kettlebell, it's crucial to get one with an ergonomic handle so that it won't slip out of your hand. This is one of the most important factors you need to consider before buying one. The King's Kettlebell features strong grip powder coated handles designed for high intensity workouts. This allows for maintaining a firmer grip even with sweaty hands. In addition to that, when a kettlebell loses its paint, especially in its handle area, it will be harder to grip during workouts and can lead to cuts and injuries. The King's powder coating prevents this from happening, allowing for an injury-free workout for years or even decades. On the flip side, Onnit does a great job of holding chalk while providing a textured grip surface. The kettlebell features a unique design with oversized handles, plus a chip-resistant powder coat that's comfortable to the grip. In addition, the powder coating prevents the handle from chipping or scratching, leading to a comfortable kettlebell fitness routine. Once again, these two competitors are evenly matched, leaving our team to give them each a single point yet again. The fourth category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their design. It may not seem like much, but the kettlebell's design matters down to its engravings and overall shape. This allows easier identification of the kettlebell as well as a more comfortable training session. The King's kettlebell follows the typical round shape of a kettlebell and has convenient weight engravements in kilograms and pounds, allowing you to know which weight you are working on. In addition, each weight of King's kettlebells has a specific color, enabling you to identify the kettlebell at a glance without needing to pick it up or roll it over. The Onnit, on the other hand, features a unique design with a howler monkey head for its 18-pound variant. It doesn't, however, have any engravings that show its exact weight. Although the Onnit is more eye-catching due to its design, the Kinks outweighs its competitor in terms of functionality and practicality. This is why we decided to give a point to Kinks. The fifth and final category that these two brands will be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with is their feet and bases. The bottom of the kettlebell should be flat to prevent it from moving around during your workout session while also allowing ease of storage. Be sure not to get one with a rubber or plastic base as it wears out quicker than its solid cast iron base counterpart. The King's Kettlebell features a smooth, machined flat base that allows easy storage in flat surfaces. It also prevents rolling over during workouts. Meanwhile, on it, much like its competitor, is made with a wide flat machine base to sit perfectly on any flat surface. 
These two kettlebells are evenly matched with virtually the same features in this category. This is why our team has decided to give our two combatants a point each. Today's brand wars is nearing its end. It's now time to decide who reigns supreme as the better kettlebell brand. The King's Powder Coat Kettlebell has garnered a total of 5 points, 2 points ahead of its competitor, the Onnit Howler Primal Bell Kettlebell. Only one brand will emerge victorious in this battle, and the King's Powder Coat Kettlebell has taken its place as the champion. And there you have it folks, the battle between the King's Powder Coat Kettlebell and the Onnit 18 Pound Howler Primal Bell Kettlebell has finally ended. If you have any contenders for our next Kettlebell face-off, which you would like our team to test, do drop it in the comment section below and we'll be sure to assess them for our next update. If you like this video and it helps you in any way, please do give it a like and hit the subscribe button so that you can stay connected and updated with all of our research into everything that makes our lifestyle great. We look forward to seeing you at the trustedshopyguide.com again soon.